Dear learners, welcome to the chapter on management and organizational support systems for the firm. This cast has contemplations on first, use of information in decision making at various management levels, second, objectives of information systems, and third, how information systems assist the managers in the process of decision making. The current page parlays objectives of information systems. Businesses are built and grown through a series of well informed and solid decisions. Proper decision making relies on accurate data, information and an awareness of all the options available, which information systems help to provide. While they vary from company to company based on the data tracked, the following are common objectives. Compare actual performance to expected performance. Facilitate efficient and timely managerial planning. Reduce costs by highlighting time waste in the organization. Provide data about the performance of employees, management, products, services, money, materials and equipment. Highlight organizational strengths and weaknesses. Illuminate product or material quality problems in order to reduce material waste. Why the organizations should use information systems. The role of information systems in an organization is to provide the most accurate data possible, so that the management can make wise and timely decisions, in order to increase the bottom line. Information systems are used as they help in. Point 1. Using organization's information effectively. When the decisions are based on the data available from the information systems, they reflect information that comes from the operations of the company. Information systems take data generated by the working level, and organize it into useful formats. Information systems typically contain sales figures, expenses, investments, and workforce data. To take a decision, if management needs to know how much profit the company has made each year, for the past five years, information systems can provide accurate reports giving the information to the management. Point 2. Running the data scenario. The capability to run data scenarios is a key decision making tool. Some information systems have this feature built in, while others can provide the information required for running scenarios on other applications, such as spreadsheets. The decision is influenced by what happens if the management decides a certain way. What if scenarios show the management that changes in variable while taking a decision? Management can enter reduced staff levels, or increased promotion budgets, and see what happens to revenue, expenses, and profit, for different levels of cuts or increases. Information systems play a critical role in making realistic scenarios possible. Point 3. Projections to assist in decision making. Any decisions that a management take, it translates in the changes in the projected company results and may require modifications to your business strategy and overall goals. Information systems either have trend analysis built in or can provide information that lets you carry out such an analysis. Typical business strategies include projections for all fundamental operating results. A trend analysis allows you to show what these results would be in the current situation and how they will change once you have implemented the decisions you have taken. The new values form the basis of your strategic approach going forward. Point 4. Effective Implementation and Evaluation of a System While management takes decisions with specific goals in mind, and have the documentation and trend analysis from information systems, they can track company results to make sure that the results are as planned. Information systems give them the data they need to determine whether their decisions have had the desired effect 
or they have to take corrective action to reach their goals. If specific results are not on track, they can use information systems to evaluate the situation, and decide to take additional measures if necessary. How Information Systems Helps in Taking Decision Information systems strengthen the decision-making by effectively assisting the management at each level of decision-making as given. Step 1. Identification of the problem. Step 2. Gathering data related to the problem. Step 3. Identifying possible solutions to the problem. Step 4. Considering pros and cons of each solution. Step 5. Choosing the solution that minimizes risks while increasing benefits. Step 6. Executing the plan, and adjusting if required. And Step 7. Reviewing the effectiveness of the plan to help inform future decisions. Let us now understand the next topic of this cast. Managers and Information Systems Information systems strengthen the decision-making by effectively assisting the management at each level of decision-making. Employees at different levels in an organization take decisions that vary in scope and type. In pyramidal structure of an organization, the information needed at distinct levels of management differs as per their operation needs. The information support systems, used at different levels of management are first. Transaction Processing System, at shop floor level. Second, Decision Support System, at tactical and strategic level. Third, Executive Information System, at strategic level, and Fourth, Expert System, at tactical and strategic level. Also, with growing need for information at different levels, these traditional correlations are becoming blur. One should always remember that, information systems leverage competitive advantage, to the business organizations through effective decision making, which, translates into profits. Dear learners, this brings us to the end of our discussion on the current topic. Thank you for following the content. Best wishes for all your endeavors.